Hello. I'm liking this jam, man. The game is very loud. Is it loud for you guys, too? We're doing some Death Road to Canada now. I don't know anything about this game. At all. Arrow keys to move, Z to open or use, so no mouse then. Z to pick up weapons, C to swap weapons. It's a little loud still. The music's pretty fucking jamming. Bathrooms have many meds. So this was given to me by Pico Bunny in chat, one of the, the subs of mine. Uh, good times. And we're, we're checking out what it is, so I don't know if it's any good. Uh, people seem to like it, so I guess they do. I don't know what kind of game it is. Fan see Fanny sees Courtney, who's a real dink. Zombies have broken in my home. This is probably your fault, and it certainly isn't mine. When a group has found the zombie bunker, Courtney called dibs on the big bedroom area before anyone else could use it. Um, call her a dink. Tell her to cool it. Courtney sweats visibly. I'm busy, I'm busy, I'm doing stuff. Okay. So she's not coming with us then. Well. How do I use... Attacks? Nope. No, that's not what I want to do at all. Wait, how did I just switch guys? I didn't mean to do that. God damn it. I don't know what the controls for this game are. See? X is attack, apparently. Okay, I should probably drop a... How do I drop a weapon? Well, I guess she just won't have one then. Oh, I forgot to change the ticker. Hold on. Okay, she picked that up. Let me change the ticker real quick. I really do like the music, man. It's pretty cool. The aesthetic is good, it's a pixel art game, but... <sighs> Fucking, I hate... I keep hitting X to quit out, and that's not right. Okay. Why do I want to pick up and throw chairs? Are you a zombie? I think we have to leave the face, huh? blah, blah, blah. We're trying to head to Canada. Would you like to travel with me? Um, I think she probably got bitten. Okay, onwards then. If 
feel like I've been bitten as well. Do I need to worry about that? I forgot what the button to open is, Z. There we go. I keep forgetting what the buttons are, and that's fucking with me, but it's just because I've been playing Skyrim. So this is a uh, roguelike, then. With kind of weird controls. They remind me of Isaac's controls, actually. It's just been so long since I... You guys take care of that shit. Hey, go frantic. How do I use medicine? Space, maybe? Do, 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 do. Fucking loving this jam, man. I need to stop saying that. It's true, though. Has this stream been going on long? For about two hours, but I just started this game. Ladder leads outside. Good luck out there. You found the ladder out of here. The story ends for Fanny, but your story is about to begin. Okay. Gotcha. Customized characters. Oh, cool. How do I change these things? Oh, okay. That's how you do it. Well, let's just random until we get something close and then edit from there. That's close enough. Alright. Is that the Doom guy face? No. I don't have much of a chin. That's like a little bit too strong. Hair. That's right. Hat? I don't usually wear one, so... Although everyone's going to want me to wear the cowboy hat now that they've seen it. Is gas mask an option? No. Okay. Can I have like a not intense beard? Just like a normal beard? That's about as normal as we're going to get. Pale as fuck, yep. Hair color. Black. Shades. Just regular glasses, please. Name. Uh, let's see, which one of these sounds most like me? Health nut, car nut, friend of dog... That sounds, that sounds good. Ultra fit, that's probably not right. Ultra buff, explorer, martial artist, mechanic. Maybe I should just pick one that I like. Angry dogs become friendly. Okay. Sure. That's most likely. 
to be me. So I can actually make, like, multiple people then. Oh, surgeon after all those... Okay. Sure. We're save over the other one. Alright, cool. Oh, I probably should change my shirt. Which of these am I most likely to wear? Probably this one. And jeans. Just regular jeans, please. Yeah, there you go. Alright, cool. We're good? Wait, I picked a trait. Fuck. Oh, I haven't picked a trait. Uh, paranoid, oblivious, charming, oblivious, considering how long I took to s notice that that was not a thing. Uh, calm under fire, nurturer, berserk, resilient type, civilized. You guys pick. Paranoid and charming are really good tra traits. Okay. Charming. Charming it is then. All right, cool. So we can we can make multiple guys. New game. Okay, we can load one. How many do we get? A buddy? Oh, I see. Alright, so we should probably make a buddy then. Well... Do we pick someone randomly from chat or do we just... Random until we get Krangus. Bees make bees for buddy? Alright. Someone who looks vaguely like him. That's probably pretty good. I like I don't like the balding. There you go. Hair color. Pink? Or white. White? All right. There we go. That's really... Oh, those are... That's a weird haircut. Maybe not that. Maybe make, like, two more characters. Alright. Perk and, um... What should we get here? Surgeon? No. Whoa. <sighs> Carnut? Mega buff. Ultra fit. Health nut? Sure. Yeah, health nut sounds right. Wait, no, that's not a thing. How about Explorer, because he's into new shit that you're not aware of? 
Uh, and then Health Nut, is that an option? No. Mysterious Pass? Sure. All right, let's Krangus this up as well. That's pretty good. I like the face at least. The hair needs to change. Creepy mustache. He looks a little bit more hipster than I'd like. Uh, perk. Let's go with, uh... Gun collector, sure. Uh, oblivious, mysterious pass, warrior, berserk. Cool. And uh, we'll make GPM because I noticed that buff was an option. Actually, we're gonna just hit random for a bit. Hold on. I actually haven't seen GPM in a while, so I don't know what he looks like. Maybe buff Riku? I don't know. Fucking... Not only buff, but mega buff. That was probably pretty good right there. You know, Pika Bunny did give me this game. <sighs> Need to wake the fuck up, though. That's a face. He has pictures on his Twitter. You know what? Let's not for now. Uh, just because it's going to take too long. We'll load up, um, Bees McBees. Cool. Go with that. Rev is hears rumors that Canada is a safe place free of the threat of zombies. With nothing to gain from waiting around in Florida, he decides to brave to the death road and travel north. 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 What? Uh, when you're exhausted, try... You start to sweat, start swinging the side. Okay. Throat. Hug bees has nothing to do with bees McBees. I believe bees McBees was a thing way before hug bees was anywhere near our community. Yalmart, rest stop, quiet factory, quiet hotel. We gotta get some supplies from one of these places. So Walmart. A rest stop, quiet factory, or quiet hotel. Quiet sounds nice, but these are probably not um, good. Yalmart would be something I would say. All right, fuck it. Uh, looks like it's been looted. Maybe there's some untouched loot inside. The zombie. Sork forecast is mild, sluggish, and it's the afternoon. Let's go bargain hunting. Well, we have nothing to equip on them. He's got a cane? Why wouldn't he? He would have a sword cane.
Seems like it's best just to not even try and fight through everything. Just attack who you gotta and then go. So I just need to walk over things. I don't even need to uh, pick them up. That's convenient. There's some gas there. I think I've got the gist. I'm, I'm getting it. You don't need to attack anything. Just stay near me. Oh, hey, we found a gun. Can we shoot it? How do I shoot it? Are we ever gonna play Oregon Trail again? It was all right, um, but I didn't have like a huge, huge boner over it, to be honest. I see where this is going. You need bullets. Oh, I'm out of bullets. That would be why. Okay, that's fine then. No, 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 you're fine, dude. I like playing games that people gift me. It's kind of a rule on Vine Sauce that you do that. Like, if someone gives you a game, you play it, so that way you can try out new things, and it's honestly a good idea. Yeah, you can totally buy guns in Walmarts. You can go to the mall in some places and get guns. Is there any reason to not loot every single room? Like, is it, like, further zombies will be a little bit more aggressive and I'd have to worry about them? Yeah, there are pawn shops where you can sell guns here in Texas. Wait, I have bullets. So... Can't you buy... Yeah, you can buy pretty much everything, man. How do I get in? Cool. We did it. A group finds a small spot along the road that looks like it's good for camping. Uh, they eat a decent meal. Okay, cool. But that's fine, because... I wonder if we can keep one for a pet. A zombie? That's a bad idea. Uh, one of her legs was wounded in the recent fall as she was getting away from zombies. Help her leg. Rev's morale decreases. Uh, Rev's medical revealed. Rev's loyalty revealed. Lose one medical. Great. That That's bad then. The group drives into the city and starts to get dark. Try not to lose track of the time. Things can get bad after the sun sets. Zombie forecast is sparse, sluggish, and near sunset. Restaurant or hardware store? I don't know how we're doing on food. Can I check that? Oh, cool. We can. Uh, we've got six food, and it looks like we use about four. So let's go ahead and get some food. Um... Pistol uses, oh, well, let's just leave this here then. Uh, no reason to bring it with us if I don't have the ammo for it. And then you have a femur. Probably don't need that. 
We can pick up more weapons just in case if we need it. You do need a license to use a gun. All right, where's the restaurant? Speaking of which, I should probably get some food. I'm pretty hungry, man. I've all, all I've had to eat today was a brownie. And that's like not real food. There's some food. We're getting some food going. We got this. Opinion on put pit bulls. People give them shit for some reason. Um, you can treat any... You can train pretty much any animal to be a dick bag. I don't see why it has to be a thing that, like, pit bulls are the ones that are known for being, I don't know, aggressive or whatever. They're, they're like any other animal. They're fine. If you train them to be cool, they're gonna be cool. If you train them to be dicks, they're gonna be dicks. Right. Yeah, you need a license to conceal carry as well. This is a different thing. It's a very good brownie. But, uh... I think I've actually had two. Alright, well, we're not finding a whole lot of food. And honestly, this doesn't appear to be a restaurant. I think this is someone's house that we've just broken into and we're killing them. But as far as, like, how adorable they are and stuff, I don't know. Um, I'm more of a... I got it. Should probably have just opened the bookcase. There's some weird policy where you can't use, or you can't, um, get certain dogs in some apartment complexes, but you could, you could fucking get a gun in that apartment complex. I don't know. We should probably leave. It's getting late. Hey. Yeah, let's leave. Uh, yeah, I don't think we really need to deal with this. Uh, you need a license to carry a gun concealed, but you don't- you need both, I think. Like, I'm not a huge fan of, uh, huskies, just- Can a human be too swole? What are you talking about? Um, I'm not a huge fan of huskies just because I couldn't take care of one, but I think they're adorable, for example. Um, cause huskies need to be, like, very active dogs, they need to get out and do shit, and I'm just- I'm not. Uh, like, if you're too lazy for that additional license, could you just say fuck it and run around with guns in your hands? Uh, no, you have to have it, like, on your hip or whatever. Otherwise, that's, um, there's some crime for that. I forgot what it's called. Um, displaying a firearm or something like that. Um. And some states have additional regulations against, um, if you have any sort of, like, history of mental illness, but they don't do a good job of checking it, so it doesn't really matter. Um, let's see, group camps out in the big fields, group eats a decent meal, you find a row of cans standing on a wooden fence. Uh, we increase our accuracy. Man in red long johns runs up, uh, my cans, my precious antique cans! Look what you've done to him. He shakes the pitchfork at you as he yells. Morale decreases. Ha ha! Well, that didn't go well. Uh, Rev is having near crippling tooth pain without any access to precision tools. Needing, needed the only option to pull the tooth out. He weighs his current options. Uh, I used to be a dentist. I saw this once in a cartoon. Force it out. Yeah, I used to be a dentist. Okay. Well, I'm not doing so well. My morale is getting shit. How do I get my morale back up? Okay. I'm getting stressed the fuck out, apparently. Uh, let's visit the trading camp. So, if you were playing two-player, you could actually, like... No, thanks. I'm 
Free medical training. I thought I was a medical professional. Rob her? What are the chances that I get killed robbing her? Well, fuck it. Let's try things. I can't. Well, never mind. What's going on over here? Nothing. He starts yelling at Bees McBees. Bees McBees yells back and it turns into a huge fight. Great. Group finds the new person, Wong. He's alone. He wants to join the team. Claims that... Uh, okay, yeah. Wong joins the team. Good. Maybe he can... Bees McBees composure. Rev is under intense pressure and starts to get shaky. His medical decreases, his shooting decreases. The city is covered in hordes of undead. Um... And wreckage that has been touched by only previous fire. The group gets surrounded. Their only chance is by sprinting through the sewers. Mild, irritated, and after dark. Well, I guess I don't have another choice. Um, cool. I think we're okay. We're good. Let's do this. Oh, there's an aiming mechanic in this game. Alright, how do we leave? Wait, did we just find a shotgun? Someone else picked it up, that's fine. This game is balls to wall hard. Well, I got this. I'm feeling pretty confident right now. It's going well. We got a good gang. Oh my god, there's so many. This is actually really bad. Let's just keep going, guys. Just keep running. Are we winning? How do we leave? Just keep moving. Will I play more Stardew anytime soon? For sure. I just didn't feel like playing it. I felt like playing, um, whatchamacallit instead. Just keep moving, guys. Let's not stop. How do I leave? Just keep running. That's... Let's just keep moving. Don't stop. Ever. Oh my god, nope! Uh, who has the gun? Great, did you use up all the ammo? No, you didn't. Let's just shotgun the crowd. We got through a good chunk of them by doing that, I think. I think we're okay. Oh my god, how many of them are there? 
Really hope this leads somewhere. And it's not just a dead end. We've been here. Great. Nope. Just keep moving, guys. Oh, nope. What happens? I'm dead. Nope. Out. Oh, we're fucked. We're fucked. This was a bad decision. Well. This game is not forgiving, is it? Until it's almost home, so I think we should probably wrap it up there. But, uh, I like it. I think it would be better two-player. Tilda might like it. We might try it. But, uh, I think that's where I'm gonna call it for now. Let me check the- ooh, it crashed. Uh, it's one of those games that crashes when you quit. It might have something to do with OBS. OBS seems to make that happen more often than not. Um, see if there's any new art, and then we'll call it there. Because honestly, I'm running out of energy, and I'd rather end on a somewhat strong suit. I like it. I might give it another shot. I don't know how I feel about it. Uh, it it's kind of cool, though. Um, I need to try the game. Um, now make chat. Oof. Um, not right now. I, I feel like I'm not being entertaining, and I feel like I'm way out of energy. So I'm just going to stop now rather than try and push myself, get some food, and then... Um, Try and stream uh, this game that Osu gave me later. Probably. Uh, probably? Maybe. I don't know. It's called Osur, oh, the insult simulator. Apparently it has Twitch integration. If I do stream later, I will set up a thing on YouTube to give you guys a countdown to that time. And you guys can just, you know, check that. Otherwise, um, Twitter, you know. If you haven't already, I would recommend following me on Twitter. Let me give you those links. Let me actually tell you about these links again, because people forget they exist. Uh, YouTube.com slash RevScarecrow. That's my highlights channel. There's a new video every Saturday at 1 Central Standard Time. It's currently 4.19 if you're here live. Otherwise, I have no idea what time it is for you. Um, if uh, you haven't already, check out After Hours. I've been using it as the uh, de facto streaming uh, thing for um, YouTube. So that way, if you haven't, uh, if you didn't catch it live, it'll upload there. Or you can watch it there, in case if your connection doesn't like Twitch, which a lot of people don't. Uh, there's been more delay because of using Restream, but honestly, it's worth it. Because I feel like there's at least 50 to 60 people who don't have the ability to use Twitch at any given time. And that's quite a few people, actually, when you really sit down and think about it. Um... Then there's Twitch.tv. It's the one that um, I've been actually talking to. How's Vappy been doing lately? I don't know. Uh, I, he Someone asked if, uh, like, if they should contact Vappy if there was a problem with After Hours. And I'm like, why the fuck would you? Like, I, I do all the work on After Hours by myself. I just speak in the third person when I'm making comments because uh, it helps with uh, searching stuff. Anyway, uh... At Rev Scarecrow is my Twitter. Uh, there's an underscore there. Uh, Tumblr.com if you want to do the, the Tumblr thing. I post videos there. And ColinMullen.com if you want to see my art. But there's a lot of old stuff because I need to update it. Anyway. I'm exhausted. So I'm just going to lie down now. I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching. Otherwise, I'll see you later. Bye. And there's an error running the commercial. Because why wouldn't there be? Fuck it.